Hi guys, uh, my name is Baz, and I'm going to be teaching you how to play dueling banjos. Um, so right here I've got a tenor. Uh, I believe it's tuned in G, but that doesn't really matter. So the first phrase sort of sounds, we're just going to get right into this, alright? So the first phrase, it, it's the one you hear first, uh, that's the name, first phrase. So, let's break that down. What you're going to do is you're going to hit the uh, C string, which is the second one from the top, you know, this one. Um, and you're going to hit that three times open. And then you're going to put your middle finger on the second fret and pluck it once. And then you're going to go to your E string and you're going to pluck it open once. And then you're going to hit the first string, third string, back to the first string, open. So the phrase should sound like this. Alright. So you got that part down. Practice it. Pause it. Practice it. Next part. So for this part, you're going to locate your E string, uh, third fret, and you're going to hit the string three times. It's the same rhythm as the previous, uh, the previous phrase, but it sounds like this. It's just higher. So you hit that three times. Here, let me make that so you can see it better. And then you open on the A string, second, third. 5th, 3rd, 2nd, alright, I hope that makes sense, so, so, yeah, here, and so the phrase that you should have so far is, you know, what you have so far um, and you know you don't play it that fast you know when you're doing the dual thing you, know, you play it multiple times and it's just it's just how you it's just there's not really tabs for this you know you play it how you feel you know so if you're dueling you're dueling you know um, so the next phrase is so you're gonna hit your your, your C string Open twice, second fret. So you hit your second fret um, on the C string, and then hit the open E string. So it should sound like. And then you're gonna hit open on the C string again. All right, so open, open two. Open to oh wait hold up this one's hard I can't explain it hold up open open to open to open to open to hold up because I always play it so fast <laughs> hold on. I'm sorry this, I'm sorry that, that sounds really bad right now so. Watch my fingers while I do it. That's how I learned. I watch people's fingers. So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one. All right. Actually, you're only hitting the second fret three times in that whole in that whole phrase. So so uh, open twice on the C string. Second fret on the uh, C string, open on the E string, open again on the C string, alright, and then 
for the part that you've really been waiting for. So, this one, people, some people, it depends really how you play it, but some people will pluck each every each and every note. But you can do like a little hammer on. But let me let me just explain how to basically do it. Okay, I keep thinking of it too fast. So, you're going to go... So you're going to go... Open one... Open one... Open one... Open one, three... One, open one, three... Wait, hold up. Open one, three... Open one open what oh my god. I'm terrible at teaching. I'm sorry, I'm a terrible teacher, but uh I'll have the tabs in the description uh for each individual part. So let me name the phrases right now. Alright, this is the first phrase. And I'm just gonna hope y'all can read tabs, all right, because uh, I'm a terrible teacher, but this is just so you can hear it. So that's phrase one. This is phrase two. That's phrase two. This is phrase three. And this is phrase four. And I'll have tabs down in the description, don't worry, so you, you guys can follow along with that. Um, and this part, you know, it's really, everyone does it different, I do it a lot different than other people, and it doesn't sound as good, but I think there's other tutorials on how to do it, but, um, you're gonna find your A string, and you go, three, two, one, um, and the, the chord things to remember is you got your C, you got your F, you got your G, and you go back to your C. So, or you could do it, So yeah, I hope this uh, works, and if you have any questions, I'll definitely answer them um, in the description. I for real, I for real will. All right, don't you worry about it. Like I, I'll answer any questions you guys have, and I'll try to be as helpful as I can. But I figured the last tutorial, it's been about six years, I think. That's the one I kind of learned off of, and to to me, the dude's tutorial wasn't helpful. And I had to watch it, like, it's like a 10 minute video and I had to watch it over and over. And he didn't really explain it, like, well enough, you know? And there was no tabs, so I'll write tabs for it. I'll put it in the description. It's not going to be a link, I'll literally write it in the description box. Like, Anyways, uh, thanks for watching, and if you think I should do more tutorials, uh, I'd love to. Alright, bye.